Hi, Dad. What happened tonight? Oh, we've been just... She has asthma, and for like the last couple days, she's been having a cold and runny nose and okay. wheezing a lot, and so we've been giving her... Uh, we're having our paramedic students run through a number of different case scenarios uh, in the sim lab, specifically in pediatrics. This is the first time that uh, we've been able to uh, get the paramedic students into the sim lab here at UH. We don't get as many um, pediatric calls, and so um, when, when you're in the moment, you need to be able to make those decisions, you know, because um, it's, it's more than just the skills, it's also um, the decision making and the different um, scenarios and different things you have to need to take into consideration. 0 0.01 milligrams per I'm learning how much they can impact the care of the child before the child arrives to my emergency room and even what I'm going to do. They're going to influence what I do. And so just making them, making that apparent to them, I think that's what kind of was their aha moment. Hey, what I do directly influences what the physicians and nurses are going to do. And what I do is vitally important, so I need to make sure I get all the information and that I can communicate the right information. This kind of career does call for a different kind of personality, working in the raw, first on scene, and the adrenaline that comes with it and I feel very proud that I'm able to handle certain situations. Um, it's, very, it's a very special job.